we are at Niagara College, and we have two apprentices here, Vaughn and Lorraine. I always get asked, what does a mill rate do? So Vaughn, so do you get asked that question all the time? Yeah, I would describe a mill rate as someone who installs, repairs, industrial equipment in the manufacturing and production sectors. Maintenance mechanic of the larger equipment. What would you do to that trade to be a millwright? Like, why didn't you want to be a carpenter? Why, why, why a millwright? So I went with millwright. I had no idea what it was. And then once I actually got in the classroom and started doing, you know, the welding, the machining and everything, I really just dug right into it. The, just, the variety end of it. Yeah, I sunk my teeth right in and I was like, yes, this is awesome. Yeah. What, what do you to become a millwright? I work a couple different careers before making the shift into trades. Uh, I'm very happy that I did make this move. Uh, there's some shift work involved. There's no problem there. But ultimately, you know, a better balance in life and work came by making that move into trades. So, so what's the name of the company and what kind of environment do you work in? I work for Reddit Contractors Limited. Uh, so we repair, maintain, operate five different hydro generating stations. Like what are the skills that you do at work? Uh, so we do welding for obviously any metal that needs repaired. If it's too heavily damaged, we just replace the whole thing. Uh, we do some plumbing, uh, just generally replacing old pipes or anything broken, we repair. Yeah. Um, some electrical. So Vaughn, what kind of environment do you work in? Uh, I work in a climate controlled environment in the food service industry, so rich products of Canada. Uh, I'll work with 200 horsepower electric motors, mixers, conveyors, rollers, uh, the installation of robotics equipment, the machinery, whether it's gears, bearings, sprockets, chains, you name it. It's, uh, it's very enjoyable. You work with your hands and you make great money. So being a woman in trades, would you recommend women to get into the trades? Yes, I highly recommend women in trades, A, because, I, well, I recommend anybody for trades because, you know, that little plumbing stuff that you do, you can take that and apply it to your house. You don't have to hire a plumber. You can do it yeah. yourself. Excellent. So I find also women are more passionate about I'm not saying men are, but women are very passionate about what they do. Um, and I find that a lot of women just really excel in trades. Vaughn, do you find the schooling that you're getting, your blocks are applicable to what you're doing at work? Yes, of course. Uh, here at Niagara College, where we both attend, uh, we go to school twice a week, Mondays and Thursdays, and we work a 40-hour work week or more. And uh, I think that apprenticeship hours are being completed at the same time as our, our schooling. Yeah. And uh, excellent. Quite enjoy it.